I'm Dr. Claudia Kotka from the Washington Institute for Dentistry and Laser Surgery. Today's topic is gums. We all like pink gums, not red gums, and we like nice contoured silhouette, if you will, gums, not pungy or swollen or inflamed gums. But in addition to that, it's important to remember that gums are attached to the teeth and they're also attached to the underlying bone structure. When there are asymmetries in respect to the teeth, with respect to their own neighbors, as well as the opposing dentition or the opposing tooth structure, certainly we can expect, we have observed, and literature shows there's damage to the dentition. In addition to that, we can also observe gums receding, if you will, or migrating in certain directions, which aesthetically, of course, is not pleasing, but more importantly, functionally compromises the underlying bone structure and it compromises the tooth stability over time. For more information on what you can do about your gums and to keep up with up-to-date oral health updates, please visit us at www.dclaserdentist.com.